Hey, what is up there, YouTube? It is I, Hangman for Hire, also known as Soundbite. On the last episode of our playthrough of a modded Skyrim, we were going to go to Usengrab to retrieve the Horn of Jorgen Windcaller. Now, before I do that, I would actually like to show off another mod because I realized I could get a better set of armor if I chose to do so. And as such, I have decided I'm going to go ahead and do that now rather than later. It's a modded set of armor. I'll probably provide a link in the description, so as usual. Trade. And oh god, the lag. Okay, there we go. Frame rate's a little bit better now. Still a little bit laggy because we're in White Run of all places, and White Run is part of the open world from one of my previous mods I've shown. So the frame rate will be a little lower in this area, but it should speed up once we get back to the regular parts of the outskirts of Skyrim and stuff. Now for this next set of armor, I'm going to need a lot of... of steel to... I'm going to need a lot of iron. Eh, ten. That's alright, I guess. I'll need those leather strips. Probably not that many. Let's go with, uh, ten. Mm -hmm. And now... Uh... I'm going to need more than that. I'm going to need a lot more iron ingot than that. So let's go ahead and go to What's Her Face down at the other end of White Run, and hopefully she has some iron ingots that I may purchase for the sake of making a new set of armor. I believe it's called... Well, actually, I don't remember what the mod's called. I don't remember what the mod is called, to be honest, because it's... I've had it installed for, on my game for a while now. It's only recently, as like today, that I decided, you know what, I want to, uh... I want to use this mod for my playthrough. I want to use this set of armor for the playthrough of the Skyrim with the mods and the things and the blah. So well, you. Looking to protect yourself? What I an ama. Damage. Ama. What I... Holy balls. Let's see. Let's go with, um... Let's go with 25. That should be enough. Good doing business. I wasn't expecting him to have 60 iron ingots. Not that I'm complaining or anything, but holy crap on a crap stick. What's a crap stick? I have no clue, but that's apparently what's holy. Okay. Iron ingots. Okay. So, now that that's done... Oh, wait. I could probably just use the forge right here. Okay. So, it's gonna be under iron armor. It's... Oh, yeah. It's called the eisen armor. Now, there's uh, a few different variants. This is white and black. And then there's kind of just like a little, you know, like, thing to cover the crotch. And then there's a light version, which doesn't have the side plates. And then there's a version called, uh, there's a version with a skirt, and then a version with a skirt and side plating. And since this character is a white colored Khajiit, I'm gonna go with a black skirt with the armor. So I'm gonna go with the Eisen armor, skirt black, and as you can see, it's gonna take 10 iron ingots just for the armor itself. So 10 for that, another 10 for the boots. And then another, and then six for the iron ingots. So we have that taken care of. And lots of random stuff here. Oh yeah, this one. Hmm. You know, I forgot about this mod. This is a mod for a flintlock pistol. A gunshot with a chance to instantly kill your target. Hmm. Requires two, two steel ingots, two firewood, Dwemer scrap metal, and two silver ingots. Hmm. I wonder if uh, they might have some Dwemer scrap metal, because that would be kind of fun to make right here and now. Sir, do you have Dwemer scrap well, metal? Hmm. Blades, helmets. Dwemer scrap metal, do you have it? Needs. Well, nah, he does not have it. Good doing business with you. Maybe that'll just be something to do later on. Once I actually have to go through a dwarven area, and I get some dwarven stuff. So... Oh yeah, I'm also using a new ENB. It's uh, called the Sharpshooters uh, Performance ENB. I'll link that one in the description at some point. And we have the iron armor. And that helmet just kind of looks silly with it, so let's just go with the onyx circlet. And then uh, we can enchant that mofo. So this is the new iron armor. I mean, the new armor I'm using. It looks kind of cool. And I don't need iron armor anymore, so... Uh, let, let's sell it. Let's just get rid of it. I don't need the steel armor. Got something for just about everyone in here. Why are you standing? Why are you standing on your table? You are not 
a conventional salesman. Ugh. We've got small weapon. Looking to protect yourself? You are not a Feels conventional damaged. salesman in the slightest, sir. And it it confuses me. Um Ah, eh, you know, I don't need the rest of the iron. And Okay, that'll do it. Sweet. Right, so we got our shit taken care of. Got two of those. Oh yeah, actually another cool mod. I'm gonna go ahead and show this one off now. Um, it's a mod for your dragon shouts. Basically, it adds an echo to them, like when uh, the Draugr used the shouts. So when I do Foos Row or Foos Row or whatever here, you'll be able to hear an echo. So actually, let me get away from the the water and stuff first, so that you can hear it a little bit better. So here we go, open world. Okay. I just want to get away from all this background noise first before I proceed with the awesomeness of the echoed dragon shout. We Okay. Are we close enough? Are we far enough away now? Okay, yeah, yeah this will work. Okay, so listen to this. What? And that is the badassery of a echo added onto Dragon Shouts. Oh, actually, another cool mod. Uh, I just remembered I installed this one as well. It's a mod that adds horse armor to all the horses of the game. So, for example, this is what all white run horses look like now. And every major hold that sells horses will have armor. And the horses are set so they, they will not die now. They won't just die like the old horses and you lose all your money that you put into them. But I don't need a horse quite yet. Not this early on in the game. So I need to go to Ustengrav. So let's go ahead and fast travel to Morthal and begin on our quest to get the helm of Jorgen something in face. Jorgen something in face. Ah. Okay. So we must proceed this way. The Legion's always looking for strong, capable warriors. That's nice. I don't care. That's nice. Don't care. Oh, whoops. What, what the? Huh, that was kind of weird. My arm was like, yeah. I wonder if I adjust my field of view if, the, if it still does that. Isn't the default field of view like 75? Hmm. Oh, well. I guess that's just part of the, uh... That's just gonna be part of the, uh, character model. Oh, balls. Oh, shit. Balls and a ball. Oh, yeah, I also have, uh, deadlier dragons. You remember my last time I fought a dragon and it was a pain in the ass? Yeah, it's still gonna be a pain in the ass. Well, I guess we're fighting a dragon now. <laughs> So much for uh, going to get the horn of Jorgen Werthrall or whatever. I'm going to be working on a dragon for the next 15 minutes. <laughs> oh boy. Hey! Stay where I can see you so that I may shoot you! Oh, thank god it's only a regular dragon and not some sort of like special frost dragon or something. Because these guys, I swear, they never land. So, archery is like your only option on these bastards. Also, I, it looks like I have a floating arm. That might be just part of the... Maybe I should check to see if this mod's been updated so that the meshes don't have that weird problem. Because it is a little... distracting, to be honest. Okay, you crazy bastard. Come at me. Stop running in circles and fight me. Are you actually going to fight or are you just going to run around in circles? Why won't you land? Oi. Hey, I hit him. I just wish that he would stop going in circles so much and just land. What the... Is that... Are there two dragons? Or is it just the one? Okay, I think it's just the one. Yeah. 
Okay, well, we got like, I don't know, a third of his health, I guess? This bastard does not want to die. Why won't you please die? I want you to be dead so I may continue my things with the playthrough and the... Oh shit. <laughs> I, I, I'm totally just dodging that because I was expecting it. It's not because it was an accident or anything. Come on. Ow. Oh shit. <laughs> I really need... Oh, ah, uh, shoot. I forgot to enchant that, uh... Thing. The circlet on my head. Wow. Everybody's dying. Dragon's killing every... Hide your kids, hide your wife, and hide your husband, because this dragon's killing everybody out here. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Why why you cause so many problems, dragon? Why won't you just be dead and extinct like you're supposed to be? That didn't seem to do crap to him. Oh well. If I keep shooting him enough times, he'll eventually die. Jeez, there's fire and dead things everywhere. Okay. Are you going to be a good dragon and be extinct now? I would very much like you to be a good boy and be extinct. Ow. Well, right now, it looks like he's at a spot where he's not moving. If I can just keep him... If he stays there, I can, uh, get him. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Okay, there we go. Shit. Ay. Okay. Okay, there we go. Is that a mage with a bow? You know what? I'm not gonna question it. Come on, dragon. Please die. And you are dead, sir. Oh. Oh, yes. Kill cam on the dragon with a bow. Like a sir. Or a sir playing a female. Or I don't know. <laughs> okay. Yes, please go extinct like the, the rest of the dinosaurs. <laughs> I don't know what I'm saying anymore. Ooh, shiny lights. Okay, he is officially dead. He, she, it is officially dead. Dragon blood, dragon stuff. And an iron sort of cold. I could totally disenchant that. And you carry my stuff. I never would have believed it if I hadn't seen it with my own eye. Uh, she is that what she was not talking to me for? A uh, mud crab? I'm right behind you. Okay. What do you want me to carry? Okay. So let's see. You don't need a lock pick. And I want you to carry that. Oh whoops. I want you to carry that. I want you to carry the dragon bones and the dragon scales, and I think that should probably do it, actually. Journal, ghost cat. Hmm. Okay. Let's get Are going. Then. I don't even know what to say. Let's see. Uh, let's see who's all dead. I could definitely. I'm definitely up for some loot. I presume somebody's dead. I really don't know that for a fact, though. Let's see, you're dead. Do you have anything worthwhile? Heal march, guard shield? Eh. Nothing, nothing really worthwhile out in your ass. How about you? Torch. That's about it. A nun root. And, eh, that'll do it. Let's go ahead and continue our way back towards the place with the thing. This armor, this armor actually looks kind of, uh, 
Let's see. This armor actually looks kind of cool. Though, I need to find some sort of helmet piece to go with it better. I'm not sure if it comes with one or what, but... I didn't see one in the file, so I'm presuming it doesn't come with a helmet. I could always find another custom helmet to add to it or enchant this circlet. Or find an enchanted circlet. Either one of those. Any one of those would work spectacularly. But until such a time that I find one, I will just have to roll with the copper circlet I am using. So we go dish way. And let's get a lantern out so I can see better. Shiny things everywhere. If I'm not mistaken, there's going to be a few, like, a few bandits and, a, like, a witch or a vampire or, or something up ahead here. Let's see, nya. Okay. I am definitely getting closer. I can feel it. I can feel it. Do you feel it? I definitely feel it. This is right right up ahead here is where the bad people should be that want to try to kill me. Or... May maybe there's not. Maybe there aren't random people trying to kill me this time. That's always a possibility. Which point? Let's go ahead and just get our... Oh, no, there's, there's the people that want to kill me. Uh-oh. 